Hey guys, welcome to Moonlight Shadows. This is going to be random messages. We have the death card, Scorpio energy. So I feel like there is something that is changing or ending in your life. It could be a transformation for some of you. I'm also seeing you're either, either this is you or someone that you're dealing with that is very sad or has some type of regrets about a significant change that you don't want this to end or they don't want it to end, but this change is necessary with the two of wands. I feel like someone at a distance could be thinking about you as well. With the Ace of Swords, someone is thinking about possibly or potentially wanting to speak to you. I feel like they are going to speak to you. They're going to reach out. Someone could be missing you. That's a random message for somebody out there. Um, this could be a Libra Taurus energy. Gemini. Oh, that's not Gemini. That's um, I heard Gemini for some. Um, Aries Leo Sagittarius with the Wands. Wounded Warrior Chiron. Someone misses you, wants to talk to you and connect with you. But that was a seven of swords. I just wanted to fly away from my hand. Um, that is someone that was not honest or not being truthful. Someone could have been holding back. And that is why there is some type of distance here. If someone, this Gemini with the king of swords, if someone does come back and it's someone from your past who was negative or toxic in your life, they are going to want to be that same way with you again. I heard, um surprise attack so it's like they could be wanting to pop up out of nowhere this person could be trying to send you a psychic attack and ruin your happiness is what i'm seeing here or they are in a bad place right now and they are trying to reach out to you because nobody else is giving them the time of day anymore do not help this person if they were very toxic towards you because this is currently their karma the universe is passing judgment and you may be having this inner knowing you might be dreaming about this person there's a lot of dogs that just came out of nowhere whoa what the heck there's like three four five one of them just barked six dogs six is the number of love in numerology i'm also getting this could be goddess hecate herself helping some of you guys deal with a certain situation with someone who was not being good to you and because we had um the death card it could be santa muerte herself that is helping you get over some type of sadness from someone that is at a distance who caused a lot of pain into your heart space is what i'm hearing whether this is someone intentionally trying to hurt you or this is you just being sad getting over something i feel like your your angels your guides your spiritual team is with you and is protecting you that's confirmation from spirit thank you I'm also getting if there's someone from your past who hurt you and was toxic, they might come back again. And if you accept them, they are going to hurt you again. This person has not changed. With the Eight of Pentacles, different random message. You are working on yourself in every way, shape, and form. With the Ten of Cups, you are surrounded by good people, friends, family. You are going to heal. You're moving forward. So the reason the universe might be testing you, yeah, it's like block whatever conflict or whatever this was from the past. Do not entertain it. Do not give it any energy. Side message, someone is jealous of your looks. Guy or girl, doesn't matter. You look very beautiful to whoever is jealous of you. 333 angel number. You are loved. You are protected. Continue to focus on yourself, to work on yourself. And the reason that you have someone from your past, it's like the universe is testing you. I'm also getting negative energies is trying to block you because there's something really good that's going to happen that you are not aware of. And that's why it's trying to block the, the blessings, but it's not going to get blocked. Yeah, this could be something you're working on, mind, body, and spirit, 404 angel number. With the three of pentacles, something with your work dynamic, a work situation, your job, or um, your um, career or business, if you have one, it's going to change for the better. With the four of pentacles, someone is trying to hold you back, watching you, trying to see what you're doing to copy you as well. I heard mimic you, but I'm also getting you are saving your money or you're being more strategic with your finances. And as a result of that, you're going to have more success with your business endeavors. If someone comes back with an apology, you're not going to accept it. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Energy. Because there was a lot of conflict. You have a choice to forgive this person. 444. The universe is protecting you and telling you not to take this person back. Because they do have bad intentions or they will hurt you. Or it will just be like another round of the same nonsense again. With the King of Swords, this 
Gemini energy coming through. Gemini moon is what I'm hearing. Someone wants to say something to you because they feel bad, but they don't know how to say it because they feel guilty. Someone could genuinely want to apologize. This could be very shocking for you. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy, and then the Cancer card. Virgo energy with the High Priestess, the Five of Swords, and the Nine of Pentacles with the Ace of Swords. Okay, so someone is going to be strategic, want to give you an apology for any type of secrets or anything that they did in the past that hurt you. Someone is really going to say sorry. And you're going to know if this person is being genuine or not because you are highly intuitive and they know that they cannot hurt you. They can't lie to you. They know that you are more gifted or that your gifts are stronger than theirs or that you can easily pick up on if anyone is like lying, like you can call on their BS basically. You can tell if they're lying or not. It's like you are walking, what's that machine called when you take that light, light detector? You're a walking lie detector. Someone is really stressed out. Or has regrets. It's like they are finally getting karma after all this time is what I'm getting. And spirit is letting you know in your dreams. Or you might literally see or hear about this person getting karma. Very specific for someone. What was this card? It flipped out. I heard it flipped out so gracefully. The, the, the chariot. You're moving away from some type of stressful situation here. I was also seeing 555 angel number. I forgot to call that out. So there's definitely a change. More cancer energy. Or this could happen in cancer season. Which we are in that now. So happy birthday to all the cancers out there. You're moving forward though. There's a change. Like you're finally being released from something negative or toxic. Or some type of stuck energy. What is a three of swords? Heartbreak. Disappointment. What is this about for the collective spirit? Clarify the three. Oh, we got two cards here. You could have been hurt by someone, a father figure or a relationship. Someone here does not want to see the truth of their flaws. Like they're trying to almost like um, say that, oh, no, it's not their fault or they don't want to take accountability for their actions is what I'm seeing here. You're going to know who this is. This could be a relationship that was very controlling. Yeah, it's over. I keep getting Santa Muerte is going to end this or the universe has stepped in. Ending some type of nonsense here. You have a money blessing or you you are leaving some type of offering to Santa Muerte or you have reached out to your spiritual team. What is this about, spirit? Someone is watching you and they know that you are not phased by them or at least that's how you you make it seem is what I'm seeing here. But I do feel someone may want to come back and give you an apology that keeps coming through for some of you. This person could have acted very immature, was emotionally unavailable, whether they're younger than you or not. They could have had like confusion is what I'm getting or they made you an option or they just weren't seeing your worth. And now you are a lot stronger because of this. And this person, I feel like this person got advice from somebody to come towards you because they didn't know what to do. And they had a friend that they talked to and that friend told them to come talk to you. And they're going to do that. Yeah, they're coming towards you. They're coming back. So, yeah, and it's a friend dynamic, a reunion of some sort. So this person was hanging out with their friend. They asked them about you. And their friend told them to come towards you, collective. Take what resonates if this is your story. If not, leave it alone. Um, but, yeah, I feel like this person was asking their friend if they should come talk to you. They were getting some type of advice is what I'm hearing. And their friend was actually very genuine with them and told them, yeah, go talk to them. Go talk to the collective. And that's what they're going to do. It's very unexpected. Um, with the Queen of Cups here. And the Four of Pentacles. Someone was holding back their emotions because they didn't know what they wanted to do or they didn't know how to handle this or they've never felt this way before. I'm getting that song by Faith Evans. Um, I never knew there was a love like this before. Never had someone to show me a love. So this person has never experienced love on the level that you have given them. They never knew what it was to have love. And now that you are there, it's like you, they got scared. But they're coming back with a nine of cups. I feel like this person realizes how happy you make them. 
with the Ten of Swords. They're ending something negative in their life right now. And they are coming towards you with the Ace of Swords. I do feel like this person is going to come towards you. They're also noticing that you've pulled back your energy. That was a Six of Cups. This person could be very nostalgic or has been thinking about you. And you are picking up on the signs and synchronicities. You may be even dreaming about them. You're seeing their name, the kind of car they drive, their favorite songs. Like anything that they told you, you're picking up on that. But it's because this person's coming back. They needed some time to clear something out for some of you is what I'm getting for the collective. But you're moving forward. Yeah, you have some money blessing here with the King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. You have a money blessing. With the Page of Swords, someone could be spying on you. Trying to see what you're up to. This could be a Sagittarius with the Queen of Wands. Someone's spying on you. Judgment. But they're not going to be able to affect you because the universe, your spiritual team, is protecting you always. What was this card? Yeah, the Nine of Cups. You're going to be in a good place, emotionally fulfilled. If someone was trying to cause any type of negative energy towards you, that's being blocked. Your spiritual team is shielding you in all times and places. You're going to be in a better place with the King of Swords again. <laughs> Strong Gemini here. I don't know why that's coming through for some of you. This person is at a distance. This person still thinks of you. This person is wondering how you're doing, if you're more financially better than they are. This person compares themselves a lot to you. The part of them wants to heal the situation with you, but they know that they've done a lot of harm, so they don't really know if they have a chance with you or not anymore. Um, this person can't stop thinking about you, or if you're awake at night, um, they know that you're not open to speak to them, so it could be their energy that you're picking up on. I'm also getting there could be someone who is jealous of you that is sending you the evil eye, and that's also a result of you not being able to sleep because you're feeling it and spirit is telling you to protect yourself. So if you're waking up in the middle of the night and you don't feel so great or you're really stressed out about a situation, it's like you need to do your um, protection spell work and connect with your spiritual team because they are going to help you and protect you, okay? If you are suffering from some type of sadness or illness, you are going to be healed. Any type of relationship drama is going to be healed as well. You're going to get an offer. I keep getting an offer and apology from someone that wants to work on a situation with you. It's your choice if you want to speak to them or not, if you want to heal this. But I am seeing here that someone does want to come back, okay? Your home and your family are protected. Your dynamic as far as family and what you believe in. Your altar is protected as well. And I'm also getting, um, if you've cleansed your altar... Um, your spiritual team is grateful for that. And if you have been manifesting some type of financial success, that is going to be making progress within the next seven days. You will see some type of change and any type of money imbalance. I'm also seeing two streams of income here for you. I'm also getting people admire you, but they're not telling you because they know that they've hurt you. So if someone has feelings for you and they're really stuck in their head and it's because of like, that's their karma for their behavior towards you they may end up speaking to you i keep getting apologies within different energies so yeah someone misses you someone yeah look at that someone misses you you could have wished for healing with this situation or this person is wishing to heal something with you so the star is a wish being granted the ace of swords is clear communication and the king of wands or queen of wands so someone is in feminine energy because i said king and it's a queen guy or girl someone is in feminine energy they are manifesting you or vice versa and i feel like the answer is yes the tower is shocking truth and revelation um yeah someone is going to reach out and then it's up to you if you want to talk to this person 444 coming through you're not expecting this or when you least expect it yeah, this person is highly motivated to come towards you or you're going to get motivation back. Work with um, Sunstone, Citrine, Carnelian for your vitality and happiness. So that's what I have for you. Let me know if that resonates. Please like and subscribe and thanks for watching. Bye.